After 10 long months, Lilia can finally hold her twins separately. Abigail and Michaela were born conjoined at the head, rare craniopagus twins. Now, thanks to the team at UC Davis Children's Hospital, mom can spend some one-on-one -on -one time with each girl. I wanted to hug and kiss every doctor, every nurse. I'm like, good thing they're not around me right now because I, they would think this girl is crazy. The 24-hour procedure to separate Abigail and Michaela was the result of months of planning, choreographed like a long and intricate dance. Everybody knew where they needed to be and it was seamless. Just for it to go so well, um, it was just a complete exhausting but pleasure to be involved in. It's relief and happiness and love and, and appreciation and you just think, how many people was involved. Members of the team recall memorable so moments from the surgery, the precarious turning of the babies, the careful clipping of veins and blood vessels, and the moment neurosurgeon Michael Edwards declared, Cranial separation, yay! <laughs> Nursing lead Aida Benitez is one of many team members who bonded strongly with the twins. For her, that minute will never be forgotten. That memory and that time will forever just be ingrained in my mind. I won't ever look at 328 and not think, we separated two little girls in an amazing procedure and gave them the best chance at independent lives. It was amazing. Today, first time I hold them. <laughs> you like it's your daughter? <laughs> yeah. It's, uh, yeah, it's unique. Now 10 months old, the twins have missed milestones that most babies their age have mastered, like sitting up and crawling, even making eye contact with each other. Until now, this is the first time they've come face to face. <laughs> Later visits went better. Hi. Hi. Oh, my goodness. There will be more surgeries and more specialized care in Abigail and Michaela's future. They have a long recovery ahead. The team from UC Davis will keep caring for the twins, and the twins will keep inspiring the team. When I see those girls and I see them smiling, and we play with them and they laugh and they smile and hold your hand, that's what we'd all like to get to in the world right now. Say hi, sister. Hi. Abigail and Michaela, no longer connected physically, but in a different way, connected to UC Davis forever. You always will be like part of our family because oh, yeah. when we see the girls, we see you, your work in them.